Salutations and good morrow everyone and welcome back to Graveyard Keeper. Today we are going to be doing something slightly different in Graveyard Keeper. Normally it is all about running around and taking care of the morgue and taking care of the graveyard and the bodies and the pancake and everything else that goes into it, the carrots, this damn donkey that's a prick, all of that. All of that is normally what we do in Graveyard but Keeper, but today, today is a day of murder, today is a day of fighting. Battle! And that is what we are going to do. So we are going to talk to this guy. What up, man? Uh, tell me about the resurrection ingredients. Some kinds of these kind of foul powder. I don't know exactly what you want. Second ingredient is blood. Okay, bye. Anyway, so I'm really pumped about that. So we are going to run over into our wonderful little demon dome here. And we shall fight. Sacrifice zone. Okay, dungeon zone one. Now, I have a little bit of food with me. And we are off to the races to do more. So let's go up first. We're looking for our blood and our nails. So that way we can give them to Snake. And Snake will give me my stuff that I require. Okay, okay. Be smarter, not, not harder. Fight smarter, not harder. Okay, perfect. Uh, we've got some wheat seeds and some metal scrap. Anything from you guys. Lots of flitch. A little scrap. More flitch. More simple iron parts. Anything up here? No. Nothing. Okay. Let's run south now. Now that we've cleared that area, we will run straight south. I know I've cleared up here, so I'm going to run down and down this way. Now, I don't know where to get the bucket of blood or the bloody nails, but I know that he needs them. So we have to just kind of keep looking for them. Not here. Okay. So let's run up and around now. We have plenty of time. Today is the day of burning. That the uh, Inquisitor wants to burn people. But I ain't got no time for that. And ain't nobody got time for that. So I'm not going to deal with that at the moment. Yeah, the first level seems almost cleared. There might be some bats or something down here. I hate fighting bats because they're constantly flying around. Oh, hey look, bats. Ooh, and a slime. Okay. Get him taken care of. And you... Oop, 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 oop. Take it. Perfect. Alright, now hopefully... He said it's going to be in the first level... Of here. But maybe the bucket of blood and stuff is going to be in here? Right? Am I missing something? I don't think so. Uh, do I have to go down a floor? I think this is floor two now. Okay. Let's eat up our mushrooms. To use these. Use. Use. There we go. We got some health. We got some energy back. Not a lot, but we got some. Okay, nothing there. Some beet seeds. A heal potion. That's good to keep. Uh, hello? I need a bucket of blood and nails, please. Ooh, this looks promising. Nope, nothing. Alright, I'm out. Running out of energy. Hmm. I swear Snake said that they were going to be in the first floor. Maybe I'm mistaken and I read it wrong. But I didn't see any bloody nails. I also didn't see a bucket of blood either. Now, I could just make a bucket of blood if they just gave me a bucket. What's this? Anything? Anything? No. Alright, so before I die, I'm going to bounce out of here. This must be floor two. Floor one is cleared. Okay. Easy peasy to get out. Strange. Hmm. Okay, well, the day of murder was successful. I got myself 25 metal scrap parts. Uh, I got myself some healing potion. 
a bunch of new kinds of seeds. Cabbage seeds, wheat seeds, beet seeds. I even got some onion seeds, which I can study. Perhaps I had zombie farm and zombie farm too. Ah. Oignon. That's cool. So we can start growing some onions. All right. So, that's what he wanted. But how do I get it? Now, could I just take the blood and make it? Like, why can't I do that? Just allow me to grab the blood and... and, and uh, yeah, uh, See? Jesus, I can make the bucket of blood. Hey, what about the bloody nails? Come on, you can't tell me that I can't make those two. Seriously? That hard? That... Uh, okay. See, look at I got three blood right here. I can go get some more. Uh, that's quite annoying because... I didn't think it was going to be that easy, and then it comes out, Hey, by the way, stupid, it's that easy. But that just means I just need some nails and some blood, and I can make the bloody nails, too. So, what, what, what have you? Okay, take that, take those, and take these. And I think I need these. don't think I need that. I don't think I need that. Yeah, okay. Zombie mining time starts right now. But first, zombie farming time. Oh, Mr. Zombie Farm! Uh, did you, did you do me, did you, did you get me my stuff? E-craft? Ah. No? Uh. Box? Are you telling me you need me to do something? Do you need a chest? To move them to? Are you stuck? Do you need a trunk? Like this? Is he- he's like... Just standing there. Is that what you needed? Ah! Oh! That gave me a lot of carrot seeds. Holy moly. Okay, I'm going to put all my seeds in this one. Perfect, 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 perfect. And my crop waste. Yeah, let's put those in there. I'm going to grab 10 carrots. I'm going to go toss them in the asshole's uh, bin over there. So that way he'll come back and bring me some more bodies. So I can make some more zombie workers. Because, you know, he's a prick and only works for carrots. So, for you, there. I have grave sites set up. I need to get better at praying. Do I have my Zambi juice? Probably not. I need for you pallet. No, I don't need another pallet. And I don't need those don't have a body yet, but it'll come down into the into the basement in the morgue. Alright, so that's where I make the bucket of blood. Right, so here's the bucket of blood. I just need ten blood, which I just gotta just keep harvesting from people. Because there's three in there. Then where would I make the nails? I have to make the nails... At, like, the anvil, right? I mean, that would make sense. Oop, did they drop me a... Did I get a body dropped off? Is that what that noise was? It sounded like a doo doo doo. Hello? Did you drop me a body? Unless the zombies have risen up against their master and are now trying to attack me. Which, that would be absolutely horrible as well. But I would understand. Nope. Whoa. Maybe it was my phone dying. I swear I heard a cool sound, but I could be mistaken. Okay, so I got four more blood here. Let's take that. Um, I'm gonna move all this to the basement. It seems like it doesn't belong up here. Also, I'm gonna spend some time cleaning stuff up because I feel like I have stuff everywhere. And that's not good. Like, look at rune books, pigskin paper. I'm supposed to take these, to scrub these out to make regular paper. Like, what am I even doing with life? 
Let's put this away, and this away, and this away. Right? All right. Also, what does it take to make a zombie mining station? It doesn't tell me. I know it was a pickaxe. And I think it was planks. I think. Remember. Um, I don't really want to run all the way back over there. That's why I know I have that second pickaxe. I guess we're just going to put some of the stuff back in the inventory and just run over there with it. And hope that I have everything that I need. So let's run over there and try to put down the zombie station. Then we'll run back, grab the body, make the zombie, and then we will bring the zombie up there and we will get ourselves our zombie time. I mean, we should have the zombie to do the zombie porter, but the zombie porter would have to bring stuff from up there down to here. How would he do that? I don't know. We'll have to figure it out. Let's run up here. I want to spend a little bit more time on these zombies anyway, because it's so in intriguing on what they can actually do. Automation always is like, ew, do it in my brain. So... Okay, here's our really shaddy cabin right about mar. And there it is, our crap cabin. Okay, and our zombie's just in here. Um, a zombie mine right. Okay. Okay. Now what do you do? You're going to get me iron ore, it looks like. Okay, I can accept that. What if I just take you out and I just toss you up here? Here you go. You're just going to work. I don't have to do anything. That's just what you do. Okay. Well, if it's that easy, a caveman would do it. Um, a stone cutter. Stone stockpile? Order station. Well, well, let's just see how this goes. How about that? An iron ore stockpile. Do I need the iron ore stockpile to move it from here to the other one? I don't know. Do you guys know? If you guys know, let me know down in the comments. If you guys know, I'm going to need to put stockpiles up there in order for the porter zombie to move things. But we're getting pretty far. We're getting pretty far in this. I'm, I'm real happy about that. Uh, let's run down. Let's see if we can get a little bit more blood. See if we can do a little bit more organization. And maybe get some sleep so that way we can do a prayer in the morning and then commence the murder. Yeah, I think that sounds like a good idea. I'll pick these berries. Berries will help with the, with the energy consumption. Oh yeah, bees too. Gotta get bees, too. I think I'm gonna save bees for maybe, like, the next episode. We'll do bees, but I think we might do those in the next one. Make sure you guys are subscribed and you guys like the video so you guys know that you, uh, wanna see some bees. Put bees down in the comments if you guys wanna see some bees. Big old bees. Capital ones. Alright. Thank you. Well, you take these and you make me iron. Now, thank you. Okay, um, 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 what did I say I was doing? Organizing, gotcha. Okay, all of that stuff can stay there. I'm gonna run up and around and check this guy that's right over here. And then I'm gonna run into the church to see if anybody wants to pray. And then I'll go down. Stairs. Yes. Good. Alright, here we go. Body's here. Oh, there's three more blood. I'm gonna move these bones. This fat, uh, that cock meat can stay there. Um, this faith, uh, the rest of this can stay, I guess. Yeah, I guess the rest of that can stay. All right, for now. Oop, let's move that over then. We'll move the monster parts over. Okay, let's run downstairs and take care of that body. At least throw them on the on the autopsy table. That's important. Our church looks so nice now, too. 
Got that nice church upgrade in the last episode, which was absolutely fantastic. If you guys haven't seen it, please go back and check it out. Check out the entire series, because there is a lot that we have done. This is episode like 16. All right, and I am on no sign of slowing down. And I have no plan to slow down either. All right, you, autopsy, give me your blood. Extract the blood. I am Dracula. I require the blood. Okay. Run up over here, make the bucket of blood, and then we're going to go down south and get some sleep. Not enough energy. My ass. My ass, you don't have enough energy. It's done. Okay. Let us go upstairs and get some sleeping. Yes, and then we'll wake up and we'll do our cool thing. Wake up, check the anvil for the bloody nails. And then... We can... Go check the anvil. See if that's where I make them. Maybe. He didn't really tell me where I make them. He just said I had to make them. We'll see. Hey, we're alive! Woo! Okay. You! Uh, no. Okay, not here. Craftsman's workbench? Polishing paste. Gray marker. Iron chisel. Nope. You? Anything in here? Nope. You? Nope. Oh well. We'll figure it out. Alright, let us go pray to the Holy Pancake, and then we shall go and finish making our Zombro. Because I have to imagine that he's done and that portal station needs to do something. Can I buy anything from you yet? Great. You don't want to sell me anything other than cookies. Well, you know what? <laughs> I'm not giving you anything that you want. Anybody for prayers? One person for prayers. Oh, Jesus be with you and the pancake. Alrighty. Oh, holy pancake. Your light is solely shining. Our church is great. Nice, 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 nice. Now let us pray for our blessing. Oh, pancake. Thank you. I think it's actually the sun. Well, we got six. Donations, your donations are welcome. Yay, everybody was happy with the sermon. Look at all the people. That is a lot of freaking people. Holy moly. Kind of look like ants. Ugh. Gives me my money, thank you. Thank you, fuzzy money. Goodbye. Look, can you come outside and they're all gone? They just disappear. They're like, yeah, we were here. Bye. All right, back downstairs. We must make out a zombie. Can I bring the zombie juice with me? Probably not. This is right here. Nah, I didn't bring it. Well, shizzy wizzy. Well, let's at least put all this stuff in there. Even the skulls. We don't need those yet. The brain, we need that for research purposes. Um. Um. Yeah, we can keep gross stuff down there. Alright. Let's... I'm really concerned that I can't make those bloody nails. I don't know how, but I'm really concerned that I can't. I mean, it would be easy just to take nails and like, boop, you know. Alright, take the fat off of you. Extract the fat. Take you, take a body. Slap you on down. I need my zambi juice. Where was my zambi juice? Don't remember where my zambi juice was. I think it's over here. I think it's over in this one. Zambi juice, come here, I require additional zambis. You, zambi juice, thank you. 
Bye bye. Also, I wish you got a burial certificate when you turn the zombies into somebody. Because it kind of counts, doesn't it? Also, it's 10 faith to bring back one zombie. Good thing I get six every time. Although, if I got that combo repair thing from doing the book, then, but I need the quill. And I need to do the, in order to get the quill and ink, either I need to buy the quill and ink, or I need to talk to the witch. But in order to talk to the witch, I gotta make a cauldron. In order to make a cauldron, I gotta get it from the blacksmith, or I gotta upgrade my own smithing. Which is why I said maybe we'll do bees next. Because that's gonna be the bees' knees. Yep, bees' knees. And their ankles, too. Look at all of them. Look at the bastards. They're all up in their, their little beehive up here being all cool and stuff, thinking that they're better than me. When in truth, they know not. Alrighty. Let's put you down. Right up over here. Come here, little zombie dude. Here you go. You can be in the porter station now. Okay. You're there. What do I do with you? No, I need to put you back there. You don't have a place to store this. Okay. Uh. Okay. So I do need a storage place. I think. Unless that porter zombie just needs a porter station back down over by my place and he'll put it there? Maybe? I have no idea. I have no clue. Well, I'm sure that you guys will help me out, though. You guys are so awesome. You guys are the real MVPs of this game. I just make it look funny. But I try. Yeah, see, look at me. We got we got all these beehives. Ah, be it bats! Ah. I don't have any time for you, Senior Bat. Uh, where do I go here? Technologies. Collect a bucket of blood and five bloody nails from the dungeon. Okay. Bring four Silver Star fish fillets to the Gypsy Baron. Okay. Woodcutter wants an iron axe. Oh. Well, that would make him happy. Uh, bring six moths to the lighthouse keeper. Find ten paper and one ink for Wagner. A handsome man calls himself a poet. And then Cory the, the mason. I can just buy stones from him. Oh yeah, that's right, the, the freaking zombie guy. Where is he? I just saw him. Yeah, Gunter. Gunter who likes to be hit with a sword every couple thousand years. Yeah, see, look at, oh, yeah, see, you can see the different days that they're on, see? So, Moon Day, Mail Day, Taurus Day, Merchant Day, Pitchfork Day, uh, Female Day, and Sunday. All sorts of stuff. Find a stamp and sell me to Herodric. Okay, I work on that soon. Also, how do I get this? What is this? Craft, Stone Garden. Okay. Oh, I dear. Zombie Porter Station. Potter's Wheel. Nope. Nothing there. They don't know. Also, I'm going to try something here really quick. Because there was a comment that somebody put in. That says I could take this guy. And I can just put him here. Oh god. Got myself stuck. Ah. Eh. Put him there. And then I could tell him to make stuff. Like I can have him make these. Holy crap. Look at him go. He's just, he's just doing it. Just like that. He's just doing it. He's just making me good old planks. Did you did you do both of them? 
Okay, apparently. Just, just, just let you do your thing then. Okay, have fun. Bye. Um, to the dungeon. Save first. What's in here? Got more fat in here. Oh my lord. Look at all the stuff I've randomly spread around. I just need to like gather everything up into one centralized location. I have more faith in here. Why did I have faith in there? I don't know. Who knows? To the dungeon. I'm just gonna go and try to kill some more things on floor two, I guess. Because floor one's empty now. Maybe it was the first five levels he said that I could get the stuff for it. Also knows I need five bloody nails. Skulls on the wall, skulls in a column. I still need to get more skulls. I should take the skulls out of the zombies. Dungeon floor two. Oof. Whenever I come in here, the sound of entering the dungeon scares me. All right. You're dead. You're dead. You, Mira. You're dead. Nope, nothing with you. I can tear you apart. Nope. Okay. Keep running. Oh. Hello. Hello, library. E open bookshelf. E open bookshelf. Really? Nothing? There's nothing in any of these? <laughs> Disappointing. You? Nope. You? Nope. You? Nope. Well, we found some bookshelves we couldn't open. That's not helpful at all. Uh, lots of evil bad bads. Can you get it in the corner, please? Got scrap, I got a health potion. None of this... None of, the, none of that helps. A lot of energy again. I know I really should be bringing more food down here. I'm kind of an idiot for not bringing more food down here, but but I guess that just kind of goes with the nature of how I always play games, is like an idiot. Um, so if I could go in, if I could go in those ones, why can't I go in this one? That's confusing. It also, why did they tell me I could get bloody nails from the first floor if I didn't get any? Maybe it was the first five. It had to, he had to have said the first five. Because that doesn't make any sense if you weren't able to get them anywhere else. Also, this is supposed to be my desk, apparently. And apparently, I don't, I don't, and my bones. Maybe those are my bones too. Maybe all of these are all me. This is all me from previous lives. Probably. Maybe. I'm gonna say yeah. It's probably me from previous lives. I'm probably just reincarnating over and over and over and over again. And this guy's just slowly losing his mind and going down into a deep, dark abyss of complete craziness. That would suck. Also make for a really entertaining game. But, who knows. I mean, you can only do what you can do, right? And guys, that is going to do it for this episode of Graveyard Keeper. If you guys are enjoying this series, please make sure you guys are hitting that like button to let me know you guys want to see more Graveyard Keeper. And if you do, I will keep them coming absolutely daily for you guys because I'm loving playing this game for you as long as you guys are loving to watch it. So guys, thank you everybody so much. If you guys haven't already, please hit that like button. Like I said before, please, please do it. It does really help the channel. Leave me a comment down below of a helpful tip that you guys have. Subscribe today for more awesome videos that come out daily, including Graveyard Keeper. Uh, hit that join button right next to the subscribe button if you guys want to be even cooler and support the channel a little bit more. And as always, guys, I will see all of you guys in the next one.